Are you sick? In Western culture, sickness has traditionally been defined as physical, medical, or mental. While Western psychology and psychiatry have progressed quite a bit over the years, there's still a long-held impression in the medical community regarding the mind-body connection. Unfortunately, given what's going on and the trends in general society, both in the developed and developing world, traditional definitions of sickness are short-sighted and all too limited. It doesn't do any good to define sickness in very narrow biochemical terms. As Western medicine dug deeper and deeper into a biochemical germ-based or pathogen-centric definition of medicine, a lot is lost in translation. While it has made big strides in bridging the effect of psychology and overall stress on physical health, there's still a lot to be desired. The bottom line is that we can learn quite a bit from Hindu traditions or Eastern traditions that deal with the concept of sickness. In those traditions, sickness is defined holistically. They're more likely to put a lot of stock on the concept of spiritual pollution, emotional stress, interpersonal sickness, and other factors that have a strong impact on the human psyche and overall sense of well-being. These factors then manifest themselves in actual physical illness or substandard physical performance. You may be perfectly healthy in biochemical terms. All your tests may come out clean, but your doctor will still be stumped as to why you feel lousy all the time. There are a lot of people who have all sorts of symptoms similar to lupus or autoimmune diseases. But when the blood chemistry tests come in, they will be getting a clean bill of health. Physically speaking, there's nothing wrong with them. But there they are, suffering, feeling like they are at their rope's end. Ask yourself, am I sick? There's nothing wrong with asking this question. There's no shame involving this. Remember, the worst thing that you can do is to pretend that you don't have a problem. How can you find the answer when you're fooling yourself into thinking that there's no problem? For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.